Hey, what's up, my people? My name is Dalton, and this is Dalton, my world. Now, today I'm coming to you because I want to talk to you about a free app. A free app that you can download on Android or you can download on Apple. Okay, you can even use it on any of your devices that you can use it on your computer okay and it's an app that i have fallen in love with again i reunited reunited with this beautiful app mm. and i want to tell you all about it all right and i'll wrap to you in about 20 seconds and i think that you're going to really like this and did i say it's free Yes, it's free. Hey, what's up, my people? My name is Dalton. This is Dalton, my world, and I am back. Now, with all the anticipation I know you have, let me tell you what app I am talking about. And also, if you need to rewatch this video, you can go to my playlist and look under Dalton's Tech Support, and this video will be there for you. Now, on with the show, shall we? All right. Now, this app that I'm going to tell you about recently saved my butt, okay? And it's a free app. And what it is, it's called Dropbox, okay? I liked it before, I love it now, okay? It has improved tremendously. But the cool thing about it is that Dropbox give you two gigs of free storage, okay? And if you're, if you're storing pictures or you're storing documents, trust me, two gigs is a lot. But if you're storing, like, videos and things such as that, hey, don't worry. You can upgrade it. Yes, it, you have to pay for it. You can upgrade it, and you can get, start getting two terabytes of storage. It's super easy to sign up with. You can use your, you know, Google account. Or you can even use your Apple iCloud email account. Okay, so it's super, super easy to do. And let me tell you what happened with me. Recently, I had to uh, redo my resume. Ugh. Anybody, that's already stressing people out just hearing about it, right? Well, I had to redo my resume. And I had to figure out all the tech jobs that I did in the past and all the other jobs so I could put it on his resume so the employer would know. So I was like, oh, and it's been over. Like, I haven't had to do a resume since 2019. So I was like, oh. and then I actually found my password and my account for my old Dropbox. So when I went and I logged in and boof, it was still there. And what did I see in my document section? You guessed it, my resume from two years ago. So all I had to do was update that, slim it down, make it more focused, update the contact information, save and presto i was ready to go okay and that saved my butt but dropbox cannot just help you that way let's say for instance you're in another state you're on a vacation in another state or even in another country okay and your id or your information is stolen okay what are you going to do? Well, if you have copies of that on Dropbox, all you have to do is ask that uh, internet 
portal, you know, go to one of those internet stores and they have them, especially around the tourist area in most foreign countries as well as in the United States. You access their Dropbox and then print out your documents. There you go. Okay? So, you know, and that could save your butt, especially if something goes horribly wrong and you're in another country. Okay? And yes, there's American Embassy, but you have no documentation. Well, I'm pretty sure they'll let you use a computer to print out your driver's license and all that to show that you are American and they can get you to safety. So, things such as that. Think about that. And recently, with the unpredictable weather that we've had, okay, and you have all these tornadoes destroying houses, you have snow falling all over the place, unpredictable snow, just, you know, you just, you stuck, okay? Just destroying houses, you could, even if it's a house fire or apartment fire, all your important documents are destroyed, okay? And you know it takes time and money to get all that back, all those documents back if you can. But if you have copies of them and, and you put them in your Dropbox, which is super, super easy, and you have a devastating event, like the tornadoes in Kentucky, okay, or house fires that happen all the time, apartment fires that happen all the time, you are not short on luck. You are not SOL because you still have your documents. You have photos of your documents on Dropbox that you will be able to access and print up if needed. Okay, so understand, Dropbox can be used in many ways, and you can use it from a computer, okay? I use Linux, and I was able to access it from Linux. So you can use it from a computer, you can use it from a phone, an iPad, a tablet, okay? It doesn't matter if it's an Apple or Android. I mean, think about that. All right, it's all right there. And I would suggest anybody to take advantage of the two free gigs and put your important documents there because you never know if you're going to be in another country, if you never know if a bad situation, and I don't wish that on anybody, does happen. And then all your paper documents are wiped out now, but you're not short on luck. You're not SOL. Because guess what? You can print out the documents that you have on Dropbox. All right. And that can get you on the ground running. So that's my app for today. I will put a link in. This is not a paid advertisement. I will put a link in the description box below for Dropbox. So you can check it out for free. Okay. And get your two free gigs of storage space and if you really need more space then of course you can pay an upgrade to the two terabytes where you then you can really really store all your important videos and stuff all right all right now that's it for today drop boxes away and i'll wrap to you later peace